Hey, welcome back. I wanted to quickly take you through a tutorial of how I use Google Search Console to improve my website's SEO and get more website traffic coming into my website. Before I jump in, if you want more SEO and digital marketing tips to grow your business online, make sure you hit that subscribe button because I'm here all the time for you. So assuming that you already have Google Search Console set up, that's the most important aspect. If, you, if you've never set it up, you would just log in here, add property, and follow through the steps to add your website on there. Uh, assuming that you already have this set up, you have some pre-established uh, uh, articles on your website and, and specific pages and blogs and whatnot driving traffic, uh, this is the initial screen that we're going to work or look at. So you have Google Search on Console pulled up here. It's going to default to three months uh, web and have total clicks and total impressions checked on here. So what the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to click on average position. This is going to show uh, the average position of uh, everything, the individual keywords, uh, pages, and, and whatnot. So this query section here are your individual keywords, but where I want to go into is this pages tab. This pages tab here is really powerful. Okay, these are going to show you your top pages that are actually driving the most amount of clicks, uh, the most amount of impressions, and the average position uh, over the time frame, so three months. So what I like to do here is I like to look through and I like to look at the pages that are driving significant amount of clicks, getting a decent amount of uh, impressions, uh, and are just outside of page one uh, positioning. So position, the first page of Google would be roughly um, one through 10, approximately. Um, you know, 11 through uh, 20, uh, approximately, is gonna be page two, uh, et cetera. And so if I know that these pages are already driving clicks, I want to focus my efforts on increasing the rankings for these individual pages. So I don't necessarily want to continue to only create new resources, new resources, new resources. I want to build up and strengthen the articles that are actually driving the clicks. So what we can look at here, and we can even change the, uh, the time frame here from you know, three months to uh, the last 28 days, that'll give us a more uh, accurate picture here and then um, we can click into these URLs as well. So this, this uh, article right here, uh, Five Drug Rab Rehab uh, Marketing Strategies is my second most clicked article. It's averaging position uh, 26. So I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna click on that article and it's gonna show me this data uh, over time here. Uh, and then I'm gonna go back over to Queries tab once I'm, I'm set on this individual page and um, so click data is going to be a little off here, so I'm going to sort by impressions instead. And now what we can see here is the top keywords that um, we're getting the most amount of impressions from uh, and our average position on there. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to mark down some of these individual keywords uh, that I have a pretty good ranking for, drug rehab marketing, uh, addiction treatment marketing, um, treatment center marketing, right? Uh, and I'm going to look at this page and see how I can uh, increase the information that's on that page to be more relevant for the keywords that it's actually ranking for. You know, maybe that's um, ins uh, inserting a new paragraph in there. Maybe it's putting in uh, a video that's specific to that particular topic. Maybe it's driving some backlinks over into that article with the anchor text for some of these keywords as well. The bottom line is that is how you're going to increase your website traffic, kind of the low hanging fruit. You already have pages that are ranking pretty high. They're actually driving clicks. You should work to improve those winning pages for you as much as you possibly can. This is a great way, you know, go, go into these pages and work through all of these. You know, if you have an established website, look through all of these URLs. Now, if you want more great SEO tips and you want to watch how I optimized and launched a brand new website and got it uh, generating leads 
in less than two weeks, click on this video right above me. It's awesome and I'm gonna see it in that video.